The best kickboxers on the planet fight under the glory banner. This is the Glory Super Fight Series. Ladies and gentlemen, we next turn our attention back to the lightweight ranks of glory. And our first fighter making his way to the ring comes to America from the shores of the Baltic Sea and a land known for its Viking heritage to make his glory debut. Please welcome Nicholas Larson. Nicholas the Destroyer Larson, 24 years old, charismatic, very affable, plenty of personality, and you know what? He's made a career of stepping in at late notice to take big fights. He actually considers the practice to be lucky for him, taking this fight on short notice, replacing the Senny Dalbeck. And in fact, earlier this year, he won a world title in Muay Thai on just two weeks notice. So whatever works for you, Steve. Yeah, that definitely works for him. Uh, he's a big time pressure fighter, relentless. Outstanding movement, really fast on his feet, extremely versatile with his attacks and his defense, and likes to throw the left, right, low kick combination really fast. His opponent was the WKN Amateur Champion, and now undefeated in three previous glory starts. Please welcome Andy Risty. The machine is a revving up Andy Risty, 31 years of age, out of Amsterdam, the Netherlands, but representing his native country, Suriname, the Simpson Gym. Very tall for this weight class. Know to look for knockouts from the first bell. And he, in fact, went out on a limb and predicted a first round knockout when we talked to him earlier this week. Stephen, and he even told us how he'd do it with a left hand. Yeah, and he really got in Larson's face at the weigh-in, too. Uh, he uses his height and reach well, but he's facing a fighter who's half an inch taller than him, so that's a moot point. Extremely fast, throws wild flurries of knees to the body, especially with his long stabbing knee. And he's very unorthodox, and he's got a springy sort of style. Here are the numbers for this lightweight contest. The first thing that I notice is the age difference. Larson is seven years younger at 24 years old, but Risty is a very young 31 years old, so I don't see, think that matters. But the quality of opposition that Risty has faced will. Risty is on his way up, but the new kid on the block from Denmark surely looks to steal his thunder. Once again, three three-minute rounds scheduled in this lightweight super fight. And introducing first, fighting out of the black corner, he is the WKU World Muay Thai Champion. His professional record stands at 39 wins, six losses, one draw, 19 knockouts on his professional record. Standing six feet even, 1.84 meters, and weighing in at 152 pounds, 68.9 kilos. Here tonight, fighting out of Denmark, please welcome Nicholas the Destroyer Larsen. His opponent is coming off of a knockout win at Glory 8 Tokyo and fighting out of the white corner. His record, 38 wins, 3 losses, 1 draw, also with 19 knockouts in his career. At 5 feet 11 inches tall, 1.80 meters, he weighed in at 152 and 1 half pounds, 69.3 kilos. Here tonight fighting out of Suriname, it's Andy the Machine Risty. Andy. The referee in charge of this bout, Marcos right, Rosales. Over the instructions. Obey my commands at all times, and you protect yourself at all times. We're going three rounds. Touch it up. Back up. Marcos Rosales back given up, the assignment up, of no, presiding no, no, no. over this lightweight no, wait, matchup, wait, wait. and these two are <laughs> raring to go chomping at the bit. They want to get it on like Kanye and Kimmel <laughs> this week. It's nice. Risty Fight. and Larson. No love lost at the weigh-in, and immediately this powder Let's keg go. explodes. Back up, back up, back up. And Larson known back up. for his flying knees Let's and go. flying kicks. Wisty also has a penchant for the spectacular Stop. show. This right should wing. be a combustible confrontation. Look, I'm seeing explosive. Duh, I mean, these guys are trying to rip Stop. each other's heads right off wing. right here. Back up. Hands are up, guys. Go. 
Risty was preparing for a tricky southpaw, and Sani Dalbeck instead on short notice faces a tricky orthodox fighter in Larson. 30 seconds gone, and it's been a frenetic 30 seconds here in the opening yeah. round. Risty is loading up so hard. I hope he doesn't waste his energy Stop. here. Break clean! Get out of there! Because if he doesn't finish Hands the kid up. like this, all these Fight. power shots are going to add up against him. Straight left hand from Risty. Larson gets tagged. And again, get tagged with that left hand by Aristi. Larson moving forward, however, trying to attack the knee, but Stop. Larson's reach. Clean. Excuse me, Risty's reach helping him there. Fight. Yeah, Risty is really attacking the body a lot with those punches. <laughs> but Risty, to me, is already starting to slow a little bit. He threw so much power into those punches early on. He's going to have to catch a second win here. And this is where Larson may be dangerous. Larson okay, comes in. Double right hand. Right. And I'm from the clinch. A knee up the middle. Risty unloads a left Start behind the guard. And Hands Rosales wants a clean break right. and gets it. Midway through the opening round. Plenty of action already here between Denmark's Larson in the black gloves. And the Netherlands, Risty in the white gloves. Great oh. right hand through the guard by Risty connects. Ooh, and level trajectory elbow misses by Larson. Yeah. And yeah. he can't throw those. No, here, no elbows. You know, the thing that surprises me is that Larson, who just landed a pretty decent knee, is hanging tough in these punching exchanges. Final 60 seconds of the opening round. Larson flashes the jab twice. Christy settling down in your right, Stephen. He may have expended a lot of fuel in that frenetic first minute 45 seconds now left in the opening frame and again Risty tags Larson on the ropes with that right hand going to the body with the left hook but it's Larson with a counter left hook upstairs you know Risty's trying to knock him out with every punch he really is Stop. that was his Please. modus operandi Please. coming into the foot 30 seconds left in the round it's almost like this fight is oh. nice sweep. Uh, it's almost like this fight is personal or something I mean Go. it's the way Risty is fighting Maybe that's the way he needs to get motivated because go, you're right. Go, uh, go, Larson taking right. the fight on short notice and Risty trying to fight. play mind games at the way in. Larson just laughed at him. There's a spinning fist, a Stop. back fist attempt clean, by guys. Larson, but belt, a please. quick start here. Wait. Lots of action in the opening round between Larson and Risty. Time. Risty came out blazing with that right hand and caught Larson right on the button, but the kid from Denmark basically shook it off. And Larson landed his own overhand right there to Risty. So neither man walked out of this first round untarnished. But it was Risty who was throwing the bombs, chopping away at the body and then going high to the head. It was like Risty was really trying to just knock him out with every one of those body shots, Marl. Yep known for the devastating left hook. Second time, my piece Risty had a big Let's advantage go, in the power strikes department in the opening Second round, time. outlanding Larson 17 Back to 1. Corner. Larson Back telling us that he likes to study and react to his opponent. Fight. As the second round gets underway, Larson immediately attacking the body with Watch two rear leg body kicks. Larson works Stop. as a mentor no. for troubled teens in Denmark. Already a father to three-year-old son Luciano and another child on the way with his girlfriend Metsy. Meanwhile, Risty looking to get into information technology when he's retired. But right now, both of them wanting to climb the glory lightweight rankings. And Risty sticks a stiff jab in the face of Larson and again does so. But Larson is using a good jab here too with that straight right hand over the top. Stop! Right wing. Fight! Risty going to the body again. Get I, out of there, get uh -oh, out of there. Uh oh, uh oh. Good. Time. Low blow. Andy. Stay over there. So the man from the Netherlands lands a shot to the nether regions. I think he's fine. Yeah, he's okay. Good. Okay, that was incidental, all right? Be careful. Fight! Time in. 
Grizzly sticks the jab and another clean jab through the guard as Larson break, is very break, effective in the clinch. Let's go. Getting admonished by referee Rosales. Risty attacking the body with a one two and then pops Larson's get head out, back with another no, no, shot no, 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 as Larson no, no, no. is cornered. Maybe 45 left in the second round. What I'm seeing here is the power advantage that Risty has in the punching exchanges because Larson just can't stop him. He can he can tap him like that. There's a triple jab. You're and right. That's a, it's a nice Break sting, clean, but gentlemen. Risty's throwing the bombs. Sure. Uh, Fight. But thus far, I haven't seen Larson get really rocked by one of his punches. And Risty working the jab. Larson trying to establish his jab. Risty comes in. This is on that attack. Then settling down here. Push kick by Risty. Backs up. Larson. Yeah, I think Larson is starting to feel the effects of that body attack from rounds one and now round two. All those punches are going to add up. Get out of there, guys. Get out of there. By Larson, left hook and another left hand. Oh. Risty, the right cross oh. by Risty. Oh. Catches Larson. Oh. Tags up with the left hand, and now Fighting. Risty beginning grab. to open up on Stop. Larson here Stop. under a minute Stop. remaining, and Larson Stop. wanting the clinch to stave Stop. off this offensive onslaught. Larson doing the right thing by getting into that clinch and holding on until they broke because he was going to get flattened. Great right hand landed by Risty. Now in the southpaw position. Attempts the push kick. Another push kick from Risty and follows that up with a straight right hand and a left hook. And it's all Risty now in the second round with 30 seconds left. Larson wants to clinch a knee. And he wants to clinch and survive. Left hand to the body by Risty. Oh. Larson on the ropes again wanting to clinch. Stop. Break clean. 15 seconds break clean. left in the second as referee Rosales calls for the clean break. Larson is getting beat up in this round. So the machine is well oiled here in the second round as Andy Risty taking it to Nicholas break. Larson. Stop on the bell. Who took this fight on short notice. Time. Sometimes when kicks or knees are aimed at the leg and body, they can go awry and land down, as Morrow says, south of the border. And here we have a case of just that right there. The low knee, it, uh, it definitely hurt Larson, but Larson was able to recover and continue here. And Risty comes in, blasting away. He's got his own wild style of throwing things, but that right hand is a crunching right hand, and he's digging to the body. It's like this shot, Larson could take a punch. That's what we know because that shot landed partly on the neck, partly on the back of the jaw. That was a hard shot. And lucky for Larson, he's already a father with another child on the way. Touch, touch, touch. Last one. Fight! Third and final round of this lightweight Stop. matchup between oh, no, no, Andy no, no, the no. Machine of Risty in the white gloves and Denmark's oh. Nicholas the Destroyer Larson. In the black gloves, and Larson wanting to close the gap, looking for the Stop. clinch, and then he attacked with Risty. Just pushing him off, and Rosales again right. wanting to, to split right. them up. Let's go. Push kick by Risty. Right hand misses by Larson. To be fair, this is a big step up for Larson in competition. Andy Risty, perpetual top five ranked. Lightweight really feels that he has what it takes to be number one in the world. And Larson taking this oh, short notice. A jumping knee attack there by Risky going to the body with the right and the left hook. And the left, the jab right through the guard. And Larson again on the ropes wanting to turn the tables with the clinch. Stop, guys, stop. One minute has elapsed here in the final frame. I have to admire Larson's guts here, though. He's taking some horrendous shots, not only to the chin, but also to the body. And he's basically fared fairly well as far as recuperating, but he hasn't been able to do damage back Fight. to Risty. Stop! Break it. Fight! Knee by Larson, who's been training in Muay Thai for seven years. Stop! Get in glory. All right, guys. There are no on, elbows, guys. which is a Go. prominent weapon in the king of martial arts, the science of eight limbs. Now Risty in on the attack on the ropes, working the body of Larson as Larson wants to try to ignite an offensive attack from the clinch, but failing to do so. Yeah, Risty's not buying it. Risty's too savvy to that move. 
He can, he can cross arm block and deliver devastating punches to the body. So he doesn't mind if the guy plum clinches him. Break. Final fight. 60 seconds of the fight. Stop. Fight. Risty in total control here. Risty, born in Suriname in 1982, relocated oh. to Amsterdam as he again yeah. catches Larson. Larson. And you heard that one right on the cup. I was going to say Risty trained by Lucien Carbon at Fight Club Carbon in Amsterdam. But uh, Larson now being given up to five minutes to recuperate. By his body language, I think he'll be okay because usually if a guy really gets hurt, they just go down and they lay there and it's, it may not continue. But Larson continued earlier. Nick, you ready? Oh, man. He got pop sound. That's not good. Was Joe Rogan who said they screwed up when they designed the male anatomy. <laughs> Flying attack there by Nicholas Larson. 30 seconds left in the fight, and there was a strike by Larson showing that he's still in the game, but not ruled a knockdown, and now Risty going on the attack again. Stop. Larson Retreat. might as well throw the spin moves, the wild moves. He needs a knockout fight. to win this fight, and he knows it. But Risty comes flying in, but misses wildly. Stop! Very clean. So the final 10 seconds Wait. of what has been a spirited affair between Andy the Machine and Risty and a fighter who took this bout on short notice, Nicholas to destroy Larson. We're headed to the judges' scorecards. Time! Here it is, uh, punching and kicking, blasting away. And oh. we got an uppercut after the bell. You know, Risty, I, 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 I don't know. He's the fight. You know, he's such a nice guy. I mean, I, I don't know. Something about Larson really got under his skin, I think. I don't know what it is. He didn't want to be upstage. I don't know what it is, but that was a cheap shot. A little incorrigible. Yeah, but it wasn't a power shot, whatever. Larson shook it off. But uh, Larson definitely stepped in deep water to just, to just welcome to glory. Yeah, and he drowned in the power strikes with Risty outlanding him 53 to 8 in the fight. Yeah, this is a wild fight with them coming out right away, blasting like each other. This is like a, like a total brawl at 3 o'clock in the morning in the back of 7 Eleven. But. <laughs> Here we have, it was Risty with the body shots. And the, the fact that it didn't affect Larson's stamina, it was a shot to me. Because he's just blasting with knockout punches. Larson can take a shot, he's very durable, but he couldn't deliver one back, and that was the problem in this fight. And there's the, the cheap shot. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, you watched it as it happened. And after three rounds, we send it back to the judges' scorecard. And once again, all three judges see the bout the same way, scoring this bout 30-27, a unanimous decision for your winner, fighting out of the white corner, Andy Risty. Andy Risty picks up his fourth win under the glory banner. While Larson loses for the first time in five fights this year, Risty improving to 42-3-1. Larson falls to 39-7-1. And these stats look a lot closer than they were because Risty was definitely laying a beating on Larson, but Larson was taking it and smiling back.